video is about the basic operation of voice control in your 24 Porsche Cayenne. There's a couple ways to access voice control. One is on the steering wheel here, this button with the little face with the little speaking uh, symbol on the end. When you press that button, you'll see the car's version of Siri pop up and it's basically listening when you see this waveform happening, asking what you want. So there's a bunch of different things that you could tell the car to do, uh, but I just wanted to show you the first way to access it. The second way to access it, sorry, if you wanna cancel it, you'll hit the, the X button here. Okay, the second way to access voice control is by going to settings, and then you'll see the voice control menu. And here we uh, will always use online voice recognition. It's not selectable right now because we're not logged into the car, but I suggest um, always having that checked because it'll learn your voice, it'll learn the way you speak, it'll learn your accent, and it'll respond quicker over time. The other way is to activate it with Hey Porsche. So when you do this and you're in the car, instead of pressing this button, you could say, hey, Porsche, and that same uh, bar will, or that same menu will pop up with the car's version of Siri to how can I help you? The only downside with this is, is if anybody is in the car and they say either Porsche or something that sounds like, hey, Porsche, it will bring up that menu. So personally, when I drive, I always just activate it with this button right here instead of having, hey, Porsche, but some people like to have that, so that's why they have the option. Uh, interrupt voice control is when it's telling you to do something or asking you a question while it's in uh, its Siri, Siri version for the car, uh, you can interrupt it and say, no, I meant this, or take me closer, or things like that, that um, you will allow. So I always recommend checking that. And short dialogues or short responses that the car, that you can give the car um, when you push the button. Another thing that you can do is when you're in voice control via the steering wheel or the PCM is you can ask voice control what things you can do. And it'll give you a list of all the different things that voice control control has access to. And that way you could learn, especially when it, it, the car is new, what things you could ask it to do. And I suggest getting into that, like if you're waiting for somebody and you're in the car, just to go through that uh, menu uh, by asking what can voice control do? I can assist you with many tasks, and I understand most of what you say. Just speak naturally. For example, you can simply tell me where you want to go. Say, for example, drive me to Redwood City, 3636 Haven Avenue. If you would like to know more about the controls in each menu, just ask me. Say, for example, what can I do in the media menu? So I suggest spending some time here and going through all those menus just so that you could learn all the different things that voice control can do for you. Porsche does this on purpose. They want you to have to spend as little time taking your eyes and hands off the steering wheel as possible. So they have a lot of functions in the car. Most every function you could do, you could tell the car to do by the steering wheel here. For instance, if you want to, the, the most common thing people use voice control for is navigation. You could, you don't have to touch the navigation button. You could just say, take me to Disneyland. Would you like to start route guidance to Disneyland Anaheim? Yes. Okay. Starting route guidance. And so now it will take you, it's here it is starting to take me to Disneyland. If you want to end the uh, navigation, you could, you could press uh, voice control, cancel navigation. Canceling your route guidance. Or in the top here, when it's uh, in that destination, you'll see the little red flag. If you go back in the video, that's another way uh, that you could do it if you want to touch the screen. But most things, if you learn to, uh, to use voice control, can be controlled just by using the voice control. So I hope that's a helpful tutorial for you to get started using the voice control in your 24 Cayenne.